Hi, hello, welcome back. So, um, this is one of the most asked questions to me in, on this channel. How to convert a CSV file into a Excel file. And I have here this CSV file for testing. Okay, uh, it has uh, columns. Okay, and uh, these labels and these values. Okay, very simple. And we want to convert this into um, Excel. So let me put first here uh, the steps. The step number zero, we will use Pandas, so we need to install Pandas. The step number one, we need to import Pandas. The step number two, we need to read the CSV file. Okay. The step number three, we need to create um, Excel writer, okay. The step number four, the is not the last one. Is before the last one is uh, convert. Oops, convert the CSV to Excel. And the final one is, of course, we need to save the Excel file. Okay, just these, just uh, five. Uh, six if we count this one uh, six steps okay to install pandas is very easy if you don't have pandas installed you just need to do pip install pandas okay very easy you just need to open the terminal and type pip install pandas and it enter it will do the, the magic for you it will install everything you need um, I will not do this because I already have okay um, what more? Import pandas. Very easy. Import pandas. And I want to uh, refer to this as PD. Okay, short name. Uh, to read the CSV file. Well, let me create here a variable that is equals uh, CSV that is equals to PD dot read read underscore CSV. And we need to provide the path for the file. I will go here and we'll copy just the relative path. Okay, paste here and the second step is done. The third step is create um, Excel writer. So I will create um, a variable named Excel writer that is equals to PD dot Excel writer. Okay, just these and then we provide the name uh, we want to refer to this Excel. Um, let's say new.xlsx. Okay, just this. So the step number three is done. The step number four. Step number four. Very easy. CSV.2 underscore Excel. 2 underscore Excel. And we provide the Excel writer. Excel writer. Just this. And the final step is, of course, Excel Writer dot save. Just this. Doing these uh, five, six steps, okay, we we can convert a CSV a CSV file into a Excel file. Let me open the terminal and let me run these. Oops, run these. It will do things. And is done already. A new file was created. This new XLSX, uh, and that's it. Um, but I want to show you more things. <laughs> I want to show more things. You see here we have here a uh, index. Uh, let's give here a, a name for for the index. It's very easy. It's very easy. Uh, where we are here in the CSV.2 underscore Excel, this function receives the Excel writer, but also uh, more options label index label. Okay, index label is equals to ABC, for example. If I do if I do this and let's run this again. Let's see what it does. Let's go here. Let's reopen the Excel file and something was not working. Oh, now it's working. 
I think it, it was the lock. Okay, so we have here um, the ABC, as you can see. Okay, ABC. But let's say we d we don't want to to have um, an index at all. Okay, we don't want this. So let me go here and let's say that index is equals to false. Just this. Let's rerun this again. And is okay. Let me try to open this. Okay. And now we don't have the index. Okay. Now we don't have the index. What more? What we can do more? I wanted to show you something else. Yes. I already know what it is. Okay. You see, we have here numbers with float points. Okay. And these two, the, this one, ah, this one, and this one have um, more decimal points. I, I want to, to to fix just the maximum of two decimal points. Okay, how to do that? That how to do that? Let's go here and float underscore format is equals to a string okay percentage dot two and f for float okay just these let's run again and is okay and let me open this again and let's see let's see those two columns those two columns here okay now we don't have uh, we just have the maximum of two decimal points okay very cool what i want to show you more uh, for example remove the others we don't want to have others at all so adder is equals to false just this okay adders is equals to false let's run again and is okay let's open to see and now we don't have adders okay okay let's say let's say we want to let's ignore these adders okay and let's say that we want to fix we want to fix the the adders okay to freeze freeze panes and this one receives a double, okay? Let's say one and zero. One is uh, one row and zero columns, okay? Let's run this again. Okay. And let's open our Excel. And now we have the first, uh, the first row is freezed, okay? As you can see. But for example, let's do let's do three okay three three zero what this does let's open again it will be the three first rows okay the three first rows are uh, freezed okay it's very cool if we want the the row um the columns sorry if we want the columns let's say one Let's see what this does. One, so it's okay. Let's open. So the first is the the first three rows is are fixed, and the first col the yes the first column is fixed too. Okay. Okay, and one more thing to show to you. One more thing. What I want to show. Oh, the the sheet, the sheet name. Let's say my um, data from CSV. My data from CSV. Let's rerun this again. And is okay. And let's open. And see the result. And now we have here um, a sheet name. Okay. Very cool. Um, well, I wanted to to do a small video about this, okay? <laughs> and um, I think is enough. 
for now. Um, I hope that you like these, to, that you learn something from, from this video. Um, don't forget to subscribe, to hit the bell button if you are not subscribed. Uh, put a like to, the, to this video. Um, if you can, uh, please uh, donate to this channel. Is very, it will be very helpful. Okay, uh, and by the way, thank you for the the person that um, gave a donation to this uh, channel. Um, and that's it. Uh, hope that you like and see each other in the next video. Okay, bye.